congratulations, your first Cincinnati title, Rafa, your first back-to-back -back hardcore titles, and now five of the seven Masters 1000 titles this year. And what does this first title at the Western and Southern Open mean to you? Well, just amazing. I'm very happy for, for everything. Um, this victory means a lot to me, a very important one, and a uh, very emotional day for me. I mean, it was always going to be tough facing John Isner in this sort of form, but it all came down to the tie breaks. He doesn't lose many tie breaks. I mean, how did you manage to sort of see those breakers through in, in, in sort of crunch time there? I don't know. <laughs> I just try my best during all the match. I'm trying to be focused and to be patient, uh, waiting for my moment. And the moment arrives on the tie break, no, and uh, tie breaks are tough to play against a player like like John, you know, surf and his forehand. You know, uh, are very very tough to. to to return, but I was there, and I think I'm playing with confidence and I'm playing at the right level to compete well. I mean, it's already been an incredible year for you, all those titles, and you must be really, really confident now going into the short break before the US Open. Well, nine at a few days of rest, and then we'll, we will try to, to be ready 100% for the for the US Open now. It's the last Grand Slam of the season, and hopefully I will con I will have the chance to continue playing at this level.